We all love images on the web. Images can be beautiful, fun and informative. Now, the web started life as a, a text-only medium. Check out these early versions of well-known websites. The Facebook.com looks pretty cool, huh? But the ability to embed images was the innovation that really made the web take off. And now we have an incredible wealth of images on the web. Here's one of millions of pictures from the Google Art Project. You can probably get closer to the picture here than you can in the actual museum. Now, given the huge and increasing variety of devices and contexts for consuming web content now, we need to think again about how we use images. I'm Sam Dutton, a developer advocate at Google. And I'm Cameron Pittman, a course developer at Udacity. And we'll be teaching you how to use images responsively so they work really well across a variety of devices, display sizes, and connectivity scenarios. Throughout this class, you'll be building a web page design for a blog site that uses several kinds of images. And by the end, you'll be confident that you can incorporate images responsively in your own work. Let's get started. Yeah, let's do it.